Joining us tonight, I'm Nick Toma. I'm Candace Kelly. After former Scranton Mayor Bill Courtright resigned last week and pled guilty to public corruption, the city of Scranton is on track now to elect a new mayor. A special election will be held this November for city residents to vote on who that person will be. Eyewitness News reporter Cody Butler joins us live outside City Hall with the latest. Cody? Candace and Nick, good evening. The mayor elect will take office in January after the special election. City Council felt this was the best option for city residents to have a say. In just four short months, voters in Scranton will be heading to the polls on the ballot, commissioners, school board, township supervisors, and a special election for the city's new mayor. They could bring hope. You know, if they're good enough and their message is strong, they could bring hope. And I think that's what the city needs as well. Tuesday, city council members voted to hold a special election in November to have the people of Scranton elect a new mayor. This will come after council appoints a new city leader in two weeks. That person will serve for five months. So there were only three options available to council based on the laws of the city. Um, this option provides the most stability for the city um, short term and long term it provides the most say for the residents. The person elected will finish out former mayor Bill Courtright's remaining term of two years. The solicitor for the Lackawanna County Department of Elections says people can start the candidacy process now. All they need is the proper paperwork from the department and more than 200 signatures. Someone who's honest, uh, someone who's ethical, and uh, I would personally prefer somebody with a financial background that understands uh, budgets. City Council will have no say for the November candidates. The Democrat and Republican parties of Lackawanna County will nominate one person each. You want someone who knows what they're doing who could perhaps try to pull some of this mess together again. Now the person who City Council appoints will have authority I will have full authority as mayor. City Council is asking that person not to run during the special election, rather run in the 2021 election. In Scranton, Cody Butler, Eyewitness News. Cody, thank you. In the special election and appointing process of mayor, there are some requirements to hold the seat. You must be at least 18 years old and have lived in the city of Scranton for one year.